Hello, welcome. This is Fabri's Creation. We come to another interesting episode. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use sugar bees to make a simple and nice breakfast. This is what we are going to do. Very simple and beautiful. So the items you are going to use are sugar beet, you and white. Um, section line we are using size 0 0.6 because of the hole in the sugar beet. They are big. That's why we are using the size 0 0.6. Of course, our slippers, our setting ribbon. Question line 0 0.4. That's what we will be using in the sewing of the woven beads. Our nether. Then our scissors. Let's get started. So you want to achieve this pattern. So first of all, you pick two of the blue beads and two of the white beads. I hope by now you know the basis of bead making. And I just want to, you see the direction of the thread. So you the you pick one white bead. Which will fall on the white bead. Something like this. Then you pick two of the blue bead. We you go under the white bead. And we use the head blue bead to do the cross thread. So this how it goes. Now you pick one blue bead, two white beads.
Okay. So we said by this time round we are making something like a V or an L shape. So you see we didn't say no, something like me. So at this point this stretch, this stretch, it will pass through the blue B. It will pass this one, two, three, four, five. I hope you are getting it. I'll do that so it goes into the beach. Then it will pass through the middle blue beach. And it will pass through this blue beach again. And the white beach, this one, then it will go back to this white beach. So we are repeating the same for this thread. It will go through this white beach, white, blue, then the white. White, blue, white, white, blue, white. And the blue, blue, and the white, blue. Because we, we don't want, you see that after cross threading, it, it should have been on this blue. And because of our design, we want it on the white beat. So it's just like you cross thread, so we are continuing. Three beads as usual. One white and two blue
So we've come to the middle portion of the bead. So the fishing line will pass through this blue bead, then the white bead as well. Then this time I will use only one bead. White. So we fill the middle portion. Then we are continuing to go through the blue beach. And this time when we are picking one white, one blue. Very simple when you get the techniques and the basics as well. So you take one white, one blue. So the blue one goes first, then the white. So we are ending on the blue. So we are closer. So then I'm making an answer the holes are big. So So we are just going to pass our fishing line through one or two beads then we cut the excess. Okay, so at this point I'm going to show you how to wrap the Slippers. We are wrapping it. So you just have to measure and you push it back. The tie is around the nose of the slippers. Then you wrap the essence around it, then you slip it. Back. I come to this back. You yeah, have to wrap it all round. All round. Very simple. When you get to the middle. So now we are coming to two um, woven beads on top of our surface. So you see that the bead has two nodes. So one would be for the right, one would be for the left. Just have to secure your thread. Right 
wrap cheese or whatever, then you take the such a way that the thread will not show So when you get to the latter part, you sew this two beads in addition. Our slippers is ready. Okay, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you really enjoy it, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. Bye.